Hey there gamers, Better TTV emotes are now available for use on YouTube. I'm going to show you how to set them up for your stream in less than five minutes. The first step is you're going to go to betterttv.com and you'll be taken to this page. If you already have the BTTV extension, just hold on 10 seconds. But you're going to choose the browser that you want from the drop down and then hit the blue button. So I already have Chrome, so you'll see it tells me to remove it, but it'll tell you that you can get it. And then once you have it, you can come back to this home page. And what you're going to want to do is go to dashboard at the top and then look for connections on the left hand side. And now what you're going to see is YouTube beta down on the bottom. You can connect to Discord and you can connect to YouTube. So if you click the button that'll be there, it'll ask you to just sign in real quick to your uh, YouTube account and it should be connected. Easy as that. Now you will notice that it does say that it's in beta. Not all the features work. I did catch one little bug already that I'll explain in a second. Now, if you haven't already uploaded emotes here before, I'll show that at the end. I just want to show how this works in YouTube real fast. So what you'll do is when you go to your YouTube channel, you go to the top, hit go live. And when you get ready for your stream, you'll see your chat and then this is how you can test it out. Now, what I noticed was it wasn't populating at first when I would type in the names of my emotes. So what I did was I went back to Better TTV, I went to the global emotes under the emote section, and I just chose a global emote to try. I did this one here. So if you do that, I think that kickstarts everything, so it like recognizes it as a global emote. And then if you type in one of your own that you uploaded, you'll now notice that it does show. Now, the one thing I do want to note is that this won't have the functionality that Twitch does, where you can't add the extra emotes uh, option down here, and that none of the emotes for your BTTV are going to show up in this panel. It's all going to have to be manually entered in. But again, once you do that little trick, maybe you won't have to, but I had to. But if you do that little trick, when you type it in, it should work for any of your emotes. But there you go. That's all there is to adding a BTTV for your YouTube channel. Um, if you would like to see how to actually upload emotes, stick around for one more minute and I'll show you real quick. Okay, so now to add emotes to your channel, all you have to do is go back to betterttv.com. Again, the link is down in the description. You go to dashboard and it'll automatically pop up with your emotes page. You'll see that I have my 15 of 15 already filled out. You can have GIFs or static images. And all you have to do is hit upload emote, make a note, uh, make a code for your emote. You might have to put in approval notes. All mine got auto approved. I'm not sure if I just got lucky, but they all got auto approved and you need a image size or GIF that is set to 112 by 112 pixels. Make sure that you put in your email address, you click that you're sharing and that you agree to the emote guidelines. And then what you want to do also is if you want to add in other emotes to what's available for your channel, you can go down your shared emotes and you can add up to 15 here. All right, and then the last thing you can do is better TTV Pro if you want to. It looks like you can pay five bucks a month and you can add in up to 50 of your own channel emotes and then have 50 shared emotes from the entire better TTV catalog that you want for your chat to be able to use in your stream. And then you can read the other things. So again, if you want to pay five bucks, if you've got a whole bunch of emotes, feel free and go for it. And there you have it. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please consider hitting the subscribe button. Feel free to leave a comment down below on what you liked, what you didn't, any feedback that you have. And until next time, I appreciate it. We'll see you around.